News we're following for you. Food trucks in Norfolk, are they best for the city and businesses? Well, some residents and supporters and opponents are discussing that right now. Right, and that discussion is very far from over. A local group wants food truck supporters to send their message straight to city council. Town on your sides, Liz Palka is live now in downtown Norfolk. And Liz, the group is giving people a chance to do that today. Well, Katie, in their own words, Go Local Norfolk says if you want food trucks in the city, you quote, absolutely need to tell the mayor, city council, and the city manager. They want to record you doing that and send it to city council themselves. Go Local Norfolk says you can stop by the 757 Creative Space today and they will videotape your message of support. They say they're organizing this because city council is not yet convinced of the role food trucks can play in the city. Supporters say this is another way to to promote small businesses and give the streets of Norfolk a new look. Meanwhile, the majority of restaurateurs in Norfolk do not support bringing the trucks, saying they'll cherry pick business from the brick and mortar restaurants. We spoke to the owner of Hubcap Grill, who has only been able to serve his menu at special events since opening last January. Not necessarily Granby Street, but somewhere, somewhere down uh, close to the bigger buildings, so that those guys can come out, they can get a you know, a quick meal from us, go right back up to work. Right now, there are a lot of restaurants that are fragile and on the verge of either closing or barely making it, and they can't stand that extra competition. Here's when and how you can take Go Local Norfolk up on their offer. They say you can stop by 757 Creative Space today. They'll be there from 11 this morning until 2 this afternoon. And 757 Creative Space is located at 259 Granby Street, and that's in Suite 250. By the way, the Norfolk Planning Commission did endorse changing the ordinance to allow food trucks in the city. They said they should be able to operate the majority of the day in both private and public places on private and public property. City Council says they want to talk with downtown businesses before they vote. We're live in Norfolk. I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side.